if you were to ride the wave of HTA, um, I think that the approach is, well, to say, well, if HTA is going to be brought in in here in the US under whatever name tag we give it, um, let's make sure it embodies some of the important features that the HTA entity should be in some sense independent, not too tied in with particular payers. Um, you need to have a broad range of technologies evaluated, not just drugs. There needs to be extensive stakeholder involvement and we need to have a data set that considers all aspects of value, uh, not only aspects that can be shown in clinical trials. Um, I think we need to make sure that any process here would embody high quality and transparent review of the evidence and, uh, as I said earlier, a clear separation of the assessment of the evidence from any recommendations on the grounds that a global recommendation may not make sense in this country and link to that uh, some recognition of the, the needs of d uh, diverse decision makers in the US. That, you know, that the idea that one size fits all probably might apply in the UK, although I doubt that, um, it certainly doesn't apply here.